Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel for another Costco haul. I went to Costco today. I spent, it was I think around like 260 ish. I don't have my receipt, so I'm not exactly sure. Um if you've watched my previous Costco haul, um I did return the bathing suit I bought in my last Costco haul. I once I tried it on, I just really didn't like the way it fit. Um, I'll leave the link down below so you can check that one out, but um, yeah, I did end up returning that bathing suit. I was quite sad about that, but I'm happy about some things I bought today, and I will show you what they are. So, went ahead. These were on coupon. I think they were $4 off. They are the women's Puma no-show socks. They also had men's. Um, I just, I really need some new socks, and these seem really good quality, so I went ahead and picked those up. Organic Gala Apples, I think they worked out to be about $1.50 a pound, which isn't too bad. I got this so cute. This is like a beach cover-up. It's basically like a robe made out of like towel material. And isn't that super cute? I don't even know what that is. Alligator, dinosaur, something. Um, I actually bought it for my almost two-year-old. So he is definitely going to grow into this. But that's okay because, you know, when they get out of the pool, they're cooled and they just want something to wrap around them so it's okay if it's a little big um, for him we just started swim lessons so I needed kind of something like that with a hood on it for him I went ahead and picked up some onions because I was out and those are actually going to go with these lovely the mixed colored bell peppers you get six in there um, for the week, I like to make up a big batch of sauteed onions and bell peppers, and I keep them in the fridge. And then in the morning, I just go ahead and grab some of my egg whites, add some of that mixture, and it makes a really good low-calorie scramble. So that is what I'm going to be doing. And I bought this big bag. There's like six in here. I don't know how much of it says weighing pounds. Three and a half pounds of yellow squash and zucchini. Um, I'm be using this for the week. I like it both roasted and sauteed. Went ahead and picked up another of the Chobani because these were $4 off. Normally, if you watch my hauls, you know we normally get the Kirkland brand, but my husband was just kind of getting over it. You know, we've had the same thing for so long and this one does have the peach flavor. Um, the Costco brand only has the strawberry, blueberry, and cherry. So this kind of just add something a little bit different, a little bit different um, consistency that he likes. Um, so we went ahead and bought another one of those while they're on sale. Now this is something I've never bought for my kids, but they have been begging and begging me. And it was on sale, so I finally picked it up and they are just so excited. You get 48 of the fruit by foot in there, so that'll be a fun treat for the lunch or wherever. And I've never bought these either, but they were on coupon. I know they're not the best for you, but I thought it'd be a good snack for maybe after school or at Disneyland. You get 16 of the apple cinnamon, 16 blueberry, and 16 strawberry. So I have 48 of them. Hopefully they like them. Okay, another one of the five. Um, you get five one-pound beef chubs in there. Um, it works out to be about $2 a pound, which is pretty good. And I just love the convenience of having them already individually frozen because then I can just take out what I need and thaw pretty easily. I got another 10 pound bag of the boneless skinless chicken breast. I really like these. Costco has a great deal on alcohol and you see my husband's already been taste testing this and he gives it a thumbs up. It is 1.75 liters, and I believe it's only like $13, so it's a great deal for that big old thing of vodka. My Costco has been out of the organic broccoli, so we have been buying these. They're the organic petite whole green beans. Well, actually, they're green and yellow beans, and we all love them. They have been great, so I went ahead and picked up another one because we just finished our bag. So I bought this, I don't know if it was last haul or the haul before. Um, I love fruit salsas, so I decided to give this a try. It's a Santa Barbara mango with peach salsa. I think it's like five something. It is so good. I ate the whole thing. I don't even think anybody else in the family even tried it. But it is just delicious. So I went ahead and picked up another one because I went through that one. Um, I went ahead and got a thing of organic blueberries. 
and organic strawberries we have already gone through about half because I went um, I bought this stuff earlier and then uh, I waited till the kids went to sleep and brought it out to show you guys um, I got a thing of egg whites is what I like to use in the morning with my peppers and onions makes it easy then this is two one and a half pound bags of Mexican blend cheese I will throw one in the freezer keep one in the fridge um, to use for you know eggs or quesadillas or even a little on my salads whatever um, tacos you know stuff like that we go through it pretty fast this is the first time I've bought these this is the turkey meatballs I usually buy the I think it's the Italian style meatballs from Costco and we love them I love having meatballs on hand you know you can throw them in your crock pot during the day with like a little barbecue sauce or teriyaki sauce or sweet and sour sauce Put that over with rice with some veggies and you have a great meal. So I decided to give the turkey ones a try. I figured most likely it's going to taste whatever, you know, kind of whatever sauce you put with it. So I'm hoping nobody minds, you know, that they're turkey instead. So hopefully those are good. This is something I buy normally. This is the ground beef patties, the quarter pound. I like to have these in my freezer for a quick go-to dinner when I don't have anything. Um, I also keep hamburger buns in the freezer, so I can just pull those out a couple hours ahead of time and have a fast, easy dinner. Don't mind you can see my doggie. That's Taffy sleeping in the background. She's cute. She's 12. She's getting old, so she sleeps a lot. All right, back to the all. Um, got the five cheese tortelloni. We love these, especially the kids just love these. It comes in um, two packs, and it's only $10, so $5 each, and one of these will feed my family of five, no problem. My husband and I both love it tossed with the um, Kirkland pesto. So good. My boys just like it with a little um, extra virgin olive oil and Parmesan cheese on it. Love, love it. So I like to keep this on hand. You can also freeze these. And they only take two minutes in boiling water. And then if they're frozen, they only take four minutes. So, you know, it's totally fine to throw them in your freezer. Still easy. Um, we just ran out of peppers, so I got some more of the coarse ground black pepper. The Clorox wipes were actually on coupon, so I went ahead and picked up some of those. You get five big containers in there. I have been in love with cauliflower rice. It's so good. I love it just sauté with a little bit of um, salt and pepper. So good. I actually like it better than regular rice. I know it's better for you. So I decided this is only like three something at Costco. It's a huge, you know, two pound thing of it. So for meal prepping this week, um, I went ahead and picked up this. So I will probably do this with, you know, the zucchini and some kind of, I don't know, chicken or something. Um, I did buy a case of these, the regular size water bottles. That's not out here because that's in the garage and I didn't want to bring it in. Um, and lastly, I got this. You can see there's one. I just opened this. These are the vanilla chocolate chunk. I have been eyeing these and wanting to try them so bad. It looks so good. So I finally broke down and bought these and the chocolate ones. Now, I thought they would have more of like a vanilla -y taste. Really, they're just, honestly, they're kind of plain. Like, my kids will love them because they'll see the chocolate on top and they'll think that's great. And I'll still eat them, let's be honest. But they weren't as good as they were in my head. You can see I'm actually eating it right over here. I pulled it out. Look, and I got some strawberries and um, some muffin I'm eating. And it's okay. It's all right. I don't think I'd get that flavor again. I like the poppy seed or I'd get the blueberry, something else instead. But anyways... And if you don't know, if you buy the muffins from Costco, they freeze great. So you, I usually like to cut them up in half or quarters, freeze them in a Ziploc, and just pull out what I need. And they thaw and taste great afterwards. So that's my Costco haul. Thank you for joining me, and I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.